receiving feedback from the last couple of general councils, we've been searching for ways to, to unleash the wisdom in the room. Uh, if you're a person who uh, isn't keen on going to a microphone and speaking in front of the whole court, sometimes we don't get a chance to hear uh, people's opinions or hear their wisdom. Uh, the table group gets to hear, and so six or seven people are engaged in a really rich conversation, um, but sometimes that wisdom just stays there and we don't get a chance to, to hear it and benefit from it. Some of the feedback from previous general counsels also included the fact that they didn't, people didn't feel like we were having the conversations that we needed to be having as a denomination. And so one of the goals this time is to have better conversations about important things. And we're doing that by not coming first with a solution to a problem, but trying to in encourage discussions about different topics or themes. This year, we're looking for ways to, to tap into that wisdom, to have more participation. Uh, we're forming discussion groups where people will be in groups of 25 or 30, and the, the discussions will be recorded uh, and shared. Uh, so everybody can hear or read uh, what everybody is saying and hopefully that'll be a less intimidating and a more participatory way uh, for us to engage commissioners and for us to learn from one another. What most excites me about the new decision-making model that we're going to be trying out is that it will allow us to have deeper conversation with one another, more time for just really listening and speaking from the heart. Um, I think that's really important for us to be able to make good decisions is that we really hear one another and that we really have an opportunity to express ourselves from the heart.